goodness. Oh my god. My cat is freaking out. Baba, it's okay, honey. It's okay. Oh, oh my goodness, arrow. It just started hailing like crazy. I'm having dinner with Hunter right now. My cat is freaking out. Ella's spending the night with my mom, so she's there. I think I'm probably just gonna call them or just send her a phone call and make sure she's okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I think we're definitely gonna lose power. I was just sitting here making banana bread, feeding my son. Let me see, baby. Oh my gosh, we haven't had a storm like this in a long time. It's actually kind of scary. Give him a bath. That's not happening. Oh my gosh, that was terrifying. an absolute mess in my kitchen but that was so scary i wasn't even planning on vlogging right now after dinner i was gonna clean up i have to vacuum and stuff i was gonna make this banana bread this is the banana bread i'm making right now and then i was also gonna make this cookie skillet so i guess you guys can hang out with me because now i'm a little scared that my house is gonna come crashing down and at least i'll have insurance evidence right Anywho, so back to what the heck I was doing. Hunter is all set in the living room playing with his toys. He also has access to the kitchen. I'm gonna clean all of that up. I need my vacuum. He made it quite the mess. I got stuff everywhere, okay? I got a trash that I gotta take out, but now it's downpouring. I got bread I gotta put in freezer bags and get into the freezer. I'm a mess. These are the leftovers I just made for dinner. So I already poured the banana bread mix into this bowl. Maybe I can angle you a little better. Lean grilling machine out of the way. Honestly, it's not gonna be that interesting anyway, but just so you can see what I'm doing, I added in the mix. So it's an easy recipe, we just need a third cup of water. Slightly beaten two medium eggs instead of one large. And we, one cup of mashed banana, so it says approximately two bananas. For more banana flavor, there's three. So I have overripe bananas and actually have three of them so that's what i'm gonna use but you can just do the two if you really wanted to hi buddy here's my three bananas mashed up the thing is i love the smell of bananas and i love the smell of coffee actually and i hate both of those items it's such a shame I'm not so much worried about every part of the banana being mashed in i'm more worried about there just being flour not mixed in so just using my rubber spatula to scrape down the sides and then I showed you that we already pre, I just sprayed it very like, no, actually I used a little bit of butter on a um, paper towel and then I lightly floured it and tapped off the excess in the trash bin. So now we can just pour in the mix. My oven has already been preheating at 350. And then this has got to go in for 45 to 50 minutes. Or it says if you use, oh, what size am I using? Okay, this doesn't say. So I'm just going to check. Uh, just same thing as a cake if the center comes out clean when you stick a toothpick in. So we're going to start 
at like 42 minutes and then tack on time from there. Hi buddy, he's going shopping. Are you naked? It's so hot that you're naked. Tell me. Let's make this cast iron cookie real quick and then I gotta give him, I wanted to give him a bath. I'm not gonna do that in the storm. So I'm just gonna give him like a warm cloth bath kind of thing. He's a mess though, he definitely needs it. Oh, you cook this in the oven too. All right, I'm gonna have to make this after the banana bread. So let me go give my son a bath and we'll take care of that. My banana bread will be ready to check in just a minute. I, uh, I'm gonna get the cookie skillet ready to go, but I'm also eating some caramel and apples. Oh, so good. Look how freaking cute it is. Clean skillet with warm water before baking, rinse and dry off. So my banana bread. Okay, let's check out. Ooh. Oh, it looks delicious. But I don't know if we're done yet. So I have toothpicks right here. Check out the middle. Okay, not clean yet. So I think it said up to 45 minutes. I was in for 42. Or 43 so we might need a few more minutes inside oh my god I have a little escape artist on my hands I just kid all right he's all set he like really is trapped in now what the heck is it just because I added extra banana it's still not done this is just the cookie mix softened butter and a little bit of water it just says mix until combined I, I i can't trust this kid by himself i just i just went over and he's freaking on the coffee table like what excuse me what are you doing you're being crazy yeah you yes you you're being crazy Oh my goodness gracious. I like don't trust to keep my eyes off of him for a second now because usually he has the living room, which is totally baby proof, except now he climbs on everything. And then he escaped because the gate moved a little bit. So he was able to like just squeeze through the gate. <laughs> and then he only has access to the kitchen, which he's in now. And then when I'm in the kitchen, like I'm either in the living room or the kitchen and the kitchen is as baby proofed as the kitchen could get. So there's that. Here's my mix. I think I just gotta spray. Can you not get in trouble for like two seconds, please? What is happening? There's so much happening all at once. Spread this evenly. Oh my God, I'm so excited. The baby is down for bed. I just ended up publishing a vlog. Cookie skillet is done, but it is so freaking hot. Give it a few minutes to cool down, but We'll try it. Oh, still soft. Ow. Oh. Ow. Ow. Honestly, it doesn't have that much flavor. I mean, like it has more of an aftertaste flavor than when I'm actually eating it. I don't know. It's okay. I think I'd prefer it with ice cream. I'm glad I got the skillet though. <gasps> oh, we're going shopping. We're going shopping, oh, we're going shopping. <laughs> Hi, Ella. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Hi, babe. 